Hello all, this is the new project voting system and in this project we are going to see how the user can register, how the data of the user should be stored inside the database, using that data how we have to log in and using this login credentials how the user can vote to that particular participant. Okay, we are going to make the simple project and in this I will be showing you the demo of this project and before that let me just tell you this is the project for complete beginners. Okay, those who know little bit concepts of PHP, okay, that is the basic level of PHP, you can get started with this one. Okay, this is not for intermediate level, this is for complete beginners because in this project I have not encrypted any data okay whatever data I am sending to the database that is in the plain text format okay because when I uploaded PHP advanced credit project many people messaged me in Instagram stating that make a project for complete beginners okay so I am just making project for them later in future videos I will be making intermediate level as well as advanced level project so as of now this is a complete beginner level project before that only I am telling you because if you want you can see this project or if you want you can just skip this project because this is for complete beginner levels and as I told you I have not encrypted any data whatever data I am sending inside the database that will be in the plain text format okay I am inserting password mobile username everything I am going to insert in the plain text format okay and also this is not advanced level because I have just used bootstrap here HTML as we all know we have to use HTML and I have used bootstrap here CSS I have not included because most of the people have their own creativity okay they want to create their own designs so I am not going to focus much on CSS but I am not going to skip any of the part whatever I have done here whatever front end you can see and whatever back end we are going to do everything I am going to do without skipping any part okay so you can follow this one completely and I will be explaining you each and every step and also I will be telling you how to use bootstrap in this project okay I have not used any Ajax any JavaScript is not included in this only HTML bootstrap and PHP we are going to use in this video I will be showing you the demo of the project and here you can see here I am having this heading voting system inside this I have just created one form and inside this I am having login enter your name mobile number password and inside this select I'm having this group and voter okay two things I'm having here group is nothing but okay the participant who has participated and the voter is nothing but we okay we have to vote for that group and also group can vote okay now here I'm having this one now here I'm just going to enter some data let me just write here and here let me just write some mobile number password I'm going to write one two three and here I have just selected here group I'll just click on login and it is going to tell me invalid credentials okay because inside the database you can see here I don't have anything okay my database is completely empty let me just refresh this one now you can see here I have just created the database called voting and inside this I'm having this login details I don't have any data inside this okay all the fields are empty so I'm just getting here invalid credentials and here below this I'm having don't have an account then register here now once I click on register here it is going to open another page and inside this I'm having this register account and here I'm having some more additional fields like enter your name mobile number password confirm password and also it is asking for photo then below this I'm having this select once I click on register whatever data I'm having inside this form this entire data will be stored inside this database and whatever data I'm having inside the database using that data I can log in that one and I can vote for that particular group okay now here I'm just going to write this one let me just write here Khanam mobile number I'm just going to write this password I'll just write here one two three confirm password one two three if both the password matches only then I will be able to register successfully or else I will not be able to register successfully and here I'm just going to select one image and from here let me just select this one let me just select this butterfly and here I'm just going to give voter okay as of now I'm just going to give voter I'll just click on register button once I click you can see I will be getting registration successful I'll just click on ok now okay it is redirected to login page okay here I am redirected to login page I'll just come to database I'm just going to refresh this one now you can see here whatever data I have entered that is being inserted here okay this status and votes I have given as zero later on it is going to be updated by itself whenever I vote the person 
okay you can see all the data is been in text format so you don't have to worry as i told you this is for complete beginner levels you can submit this project as a complete beginner level okay you are not going to make this kind of project when you are working in industries or when you are working in some companies you will not be making this kind of projects let me be clear with that you will be encrypting all the data okay even if the database is getting hacked whatever data we are having inside the database that should not get robbed okay so we are not going to store the data in the text format we will always store the data in the encrypted format okay so for that you can do password hashing as of now we are not going to see but in my later videos i'm going to do intermediate level project then you will understand that in more better way now this data is been inserted and here i have redirected to login page now from here i'm just going to copy this username i'll just copy this one and here i'm going to paste then password okay let me just copy this mobile number i'll copy this mobile number and here i'm just going to paste then password 1 2 3 and my voter was okay whatever standard i have given that is nothing but voter so i'm just going to select voter i'll just click on login once i click on login you will see that i will be redirected to dashboard page and inside this you can see here it is telling me no groups available right now okay now i don't have any groups to vote but you can see here i'm having this user profile i'm having the name mobile number and the status you can see here not voted because i have not voted anything and also groups are not present here so here i'm having no groups available right now to vote here you can see here i'm having two buttons back button and log out button i'll just log out from here okay now here i'm just going to register as a group now now here let me just write here sanya mobile number i'm just going to give same because i don't want to give another mobile number password also i'm just going to give 1 2 3 i'll just select one photo from here and photo let me just write here book book i'm going to give and instead of this sanya let me just write here book okay my group name is book and photo i have selected as book now here i'm giving here group i'll just click on register okay once i click you can see registration successful okay i'll just come to database i'll refresh this one now that data will be stored as a group now i'll come here now you can see here i'm having book okay my username is book now that is nothing but group you can see inside standard i'm having this group now what i'm going to do is i'm just going to copy this one and here i'm just going to paste then mobile number is the same password 1 2 3 now i am just going to select group here i'll just click on login now once i click on login you can see here i'll be getting this group okay whatever group i have inserted that group will be coming here okay now this group can vote for this group okay group can also vote for that particular group and also voter can use okay how many groups i will be adding that many groups will be coming here okay now i'll just log out from here i'll, I'll just log in using user now i'll copy i'll paste mobile number password 1 2 3 i'll just click on voter okay this is khanam okay let me just copy khanam and here i'm going to paste i'll just log in okay now once i log in using khanam you can see for khanam i'm getting this group okay because only one group i have added inside the database so that group is been displayed now now you can see the status of khanam is not voted and here i'm having this button to vote now i'm just going to vote for this one okay i have just voted and here i'm having voting successful i'll just click on okay now you can see the button is been changed to voted and the status of khanam is voted now okay this is how we are going to create this one and also you can see the votes is been increased to one and the group name is nothing but book okay if you want you can add any group name that is basically a participant who is participated in voting and we are the voters we are going to vote this particular person okay now here i'm just going to log out now using another user i'm just going to register here let me just register using sanya and here mobile number i'm just going to give same password okay now if i just don't give same password you can see the passwords are different now i'll just choose one image from here i'll just select this image open i'll be uh, using as a voter okay i'll just go as a voter i'll just click on register you can see passwords do not match i will be getting this alert so here again i'm just going to register using sanya i'll just give the same mobile number password 123 123 i'm going to select one file from here i'll just select this bookmark then finally i'm just going to give here voter i'll just click on register okay now registration successful and also i'm just going to register one group here let me just write here uh, browsers okay browsers i'm just going to write password 1 2 3 confirm password 1 2 3 choose file and from here i'm just going to select one browsers image 
let me just scroll down okay here i'll be selecting this one and here okay as a group i'm just going to register i'll just click on register registration successful i'll just come here i'll refresh this one Okay, now inside the database that one user okay voter and also the group will be added you can see all the voter and the group will be added now basically i'm having two groups and two voters now now you can see for status you can see status has been updated and for this group okay for this book group i have got one vote and vote is also been updated here now status has been updated to one because khanam is already voted so i'm having the status as one if okay sanya is not voted so i'm having the status as zero now one sanya vote for any one of this group then the status will be changed to one here okay now i'll be logging through sanya okay now for sanya i will be having two groups available i'll just copy this one and here i'm going to paste then i'm just going to copy this mobile number i'll just paste i'll just give the password and finally i'm just going to give the voter because sanya is the voter i'll just click on login okay now you can see for sanya i'm having two groups that okay that is nothing but book group and browsers group okay for books i'm having this one vote because khanam is already voted for this one so the vote is been updated okay now here i'm having this chrome okay now sanya is not voted so i'm having the status as not voted now once i give the vote for this one you can see here voting successful and the votes will be updated here and you can see the status is voted now now sanya cannot vote okay only once the person can vote and now here i will be having this one now if i register you using another user and if i vote for this particular browsers then the voting gets updated okay now let me just come to database i'll refresh this one okay now you can see here the status of sanya is been changed to one and the votes of browsers is been changed to one okay this is how we are going to make the simple voting system let me just repeat this again this project is for complete beginner level because i have not encrypted any data you cannot use this project as an intermediate level and you cannot use this project in any companies or any industries that's all from my end this was the demo of our project and we are going to make this project now so let's get started with this project i will be uploading step by step series in this thank you for listening have a great day